Hello and welcome to Heroes of Mind Magic 3. All the mods. Technically not inaccurate. So I went to see after my Hero Hours video um, if the Heroes of Mod Magic um, 3 community has grown. And it has. And there's a lot of mods now. Apparently these days they go with the Heroes 3 launcher, which you can find at heroes3wog.net. This launcher contains literally all the mods. So yeah, okay, there's even a mod manager here, which lets you add even more mods. So, y you know, you know, it, there's actually a fair number of different things there. Ooh, there's an F5 to save mod. A anyway, <clears throat> but this is the thing. This is a major mod in the Wake of the Gods. It was the last one I played when I last played Heroes of My Magic 3 and it changes everything about the game. It's a little bit harder. Just, yeah, it is what it is. Now, Horn the Abyss is one I've never heard of before, but I looked it up and it's apparently a pirate-based one game, um, one by, made by some Russian modders. And in Master of Puppets, just adds more classes and more stuff to the game, apparently. So, I kind of want to play all of them, but obviously today I'm just going to play one of them. And if you like this video, I'll go back and play the others. So without further ado, let's just get started, get into it. Well, that was quick and easy. All right, here we are in, um, here is my magic three. Now it should be said, I quite like this game, though it's been a very, very long time since I've played it. There's a bunch of different mo options you can choose and I've already went through and or modified a bunch of them. Are they good? Are they? Do they do anything? Are they actually interesting? Who knows? You also got scenarios which go up to extra large, but something I noticed is it also goes even larger. So there's extra large, there's huge, there's extra huge, and then there's gigantic, and you can even enable and disable the underground. So let's go to gigantic. I'm going to two enemies because honestly, I don't want to ever see my enemies. Essentially, I just want to be a playthrough explore. Um, I also found out that uh, realistically, you probably want monsters to be relatively weak, from what I can tell. Because yeah, I don't know what I'm doing again yet. I need to get myself back, my head back around it. So I'm not going to try and push things too ba badly. But yeah, there's a bunch of different options here. It's beautiful. I don't think there's any new things. Like I'm thinking maybe Conflux, but I, I'm pretty sure I vaguely remember that in the original too. But the rest of them there, Fortress, Stronghold, Dungeon, they're all con existing people. So I'm just going to leave with random and see what happens. And we're just going to get started. Now I don't, hopefully it won't take too long. I remember last time I played Heroes of Magic 3 with mods, it took forever to make the map. Apparently not this time. Okay. A few garrison sounds good to me. Alright. Got a bunch of mods we've enabled here. So these are advanced game options. Um, yes, I think, I think we're good here. So I'm just going to go through a neutral settings. Now, I've already sort of I, I tried doing that and that was a very, very bad idea. So I'm just going to go with medium. Okay. Always random hero. No, no, I don't want it all. I don't want the hero to be there. Um, tough at karmic battles. That was the one. No, no, I'm good. Low level growth. Oh, interesting. See, I, I put on low level growth. That might explain a few things. Faster neutrals growth, meh, next neutrals to fig. Regular neutrals and the event adventure map will transform to mixed neutrals. Okay. Enhanced enchantment. Meh. Double stack size. You also use this option later during the game if you want to increase your challenge. Yes, that's what I want to do. Yes. I can increase this later, then that's fine. In fact, if that's the case, I'm fairly happy. Eh, okay. Single main hero playstyle. Okay, well, fair enough. I am trying to do a single main thing one, so that's fair. Alright, let's go. Your chance of battle roll is 23%. That's okay. I think get AI options, and I'm pretty happy. I'm just going to turn on progressive difficulty here. If I turn on progressive difficulty, it means 
that basically it will slowly go from easy to medium to hard to extreme to extreme and then I'll die. So let's see. Um, let's say 50 and 100 for what day they should increase. So I've got time. Basically, I've got time to steamroll before things hit the floor. All right. Um, don't need to modify these, I think. Oh, heroes move twice as far. Fast to be quite nice. Quite nice. Rogues ambush the unwary. No, thank you. All right. So, as you can see here, we start off. It looks like we are Conflux, which is the one I'm least, the one I was not sure is actually exists as in, actually existed before, and I'm still not entirely sure if this is brand new or not. So, um, in Heroes of My Magic 3, you it's exactly the same as Hero Hour, Heroes Hour, in that you can build up your base. I, at the moment, am going to probably start by building a Mage's Guild, because this will allow my character to learn spells. So, if I go in here and... Oh. Okay, but I don't... Oh, she's already got a spell book. Okay, that's fine. Um, as this character does. Ooh, I can recruit Air Elementals. Okay, let's go for it. Some new air elementals for the army. What else can I recruit here? Right, yeah, I'm 99% sure I haven't seen this before. Oh, no, Pixies I have. Ah, oh, I'm not sure. Actually. Alright, fortunately we need to upgrade those Pixies to get anything good out of them. So that's a little bit annoying. At the moment we've got a village tall. Okay, there's nothing else we're going to do here. So, as you can see, we've got a map and we can now explore it however we would like. We've also got a massive quantity of... Uh, slots that we can ex use artifacts with and we got tons of skills we can get it, it's pretty it's pretty nice all things considered so at the moment i'm going to start exploring we'll go to school of magic first up i reckon I'm assuming we can there we go and we seem to be a spellcaster, so i'm gonna give myself some spell power let's see we've got a garrison but eh, that seems way too strong for us got an altar of sacrifice we've also got a medusa store don't know if that contains enemies or not. Can't seem to get there anyway, so. Sacrifice artifacts for experience. We don't have any artifacts just yet. So it looks like there's something over here enemy-wise, but I can't see it quite now. So, yeah, let's go. So there's a few different mechanics in this game, such as the ability to find treasures by using obelisks. We can go underground and explore there instead. So, yeah. Okay, that's a lot of ogres. That's a fair number of sprites too. I feel like this. How many air elements? Is that? That's that's a lot of air elementals. This is meant to be small stacks. Oh god, what do the larger stacks look like? Right, let's explore what we can. We don't want to take any undue risks. All right. Well, okay. You are a commander, apparently, Eleanor. An astral spirit. Attack is five, defense is five, damage is sixteen, magic power is one. So I guess that means attack skill. And you can choose either basic advanced first aid, resurrection ability. Okay. Or basic sorcery. Let's bring you down the basic sorcery path for now. But yes. Let's keep on exploring. Oh good, a mind. We need mines ASAP because mines are important. We also need to start upgrading stuff, so I'm Ooh, Magic University, where you can learn any or all of the four magic spell, um, things. Okay. Schools of Magic. Okay, fair enough. Obviously, this place is very magic heavy. Let's go for a town hall, though, to increase to get our uh, money up a little bit. Anything which increases your resources is a good idea. Anything which increases your total amount of resources is fairly good as well. Now, how much you have? You have 10, and then we got a few. Oh, they got upgraded. Okay. Sorry, when you said upgrade, I didn't think you meant mine. All right, so we got 35 sprites, 10 air elementals, and 2 water elementals. Would there be enough to beat 20 to 49 air elementals? I don't know. Okay. The dwarves are looking mighty killable, the imps are not. That's all good. So, armies, ballistas. Is, okay, let's get another hero. Let's get another 
magic. If they want to double us down the magic, let's at least finish off our uh, magic spell book as quickly as possible, then shall, shan't we? Alright, let's keep exploring. So we've got, ooh, a couple of spell, actually a lot of spell things. Okay, they really want me to double down on... They really want me to, like, double down on the spell learning, don't they? I don't think we've got a little three spell. Alright. Exploration wise, I've got to say, um, we're not getting too far just yet, but that's okay. Still no powers to actually do anything building wise, so let's get uh, more spells and send it back. If nothing else, she'll be absolutely extremely prepared for casting spells. Yeah, she, she'll now have all these spells. She won't necessarily have the ability to use them, but that'll do. In which case, though, with these spells, I might be able to take a, take a chance on these air elementals. Let's go up here and see if we can get around without fighting it, though, because that would be even better. Alright. Wait, what? We can really just keep increasing? How much is this? How is this not using up all our resources? Okay, sure. Don't even know what that did in comparison to the last level. Okay. Apparently it's wasting all of my resources. It's okay. That's okay. Hopefully we've got ages till we meet the um, enemies. When we'll get killed. Those dragonflies we can almost take down, but is Sapphire Defense worth it? I don't know. Alright, let's go for some magic power if we are going down this path. We've got some more magic and we can get a basic scholar. Allows heroes to teach each other first and second level skills. Mm, we don't have any heroes yet. Additional sorcery causes hero spells to inflict additional damage. Yep, let's grab that for now. <sighs> okay. They really want me to learn magic, don't they? Every single thing around here is this magic, this, magic, that. Fair enough, I suppose. Let's try saving, because apparently... Wait, what? Requires fort. Oh, that's why it's not there, because I need to build the bloody fort. Okay, here I was thinking I just didn't have the resources for it, but it says I need the fort. Okay. Well, I've got a fort now, so I've actually got a nice, actually leveled village. I probably should do that in the first turn. That's okay. I don't think I learnt, lost too much from this strategy. Fantastic! Brings me gold every week. Beautiful. Alright, so Crusaders are a little bit higher end. Let's just keep on looking out there. There's a spell scroll and a mystic garden. Very nice. A gold or gems. Very nice indeed. We have another spell. These men are quite powerful. Let's uh, try to stay away from those for now. All these are weak enemies, I should say, but they're... Hmm, I don't have the numbers. Alright. We will, though. So, let's get a altar. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, I definitely haven't. This is definitely not something new to me. This is something new to me because. Let's get a pixie gun. Okay. And then we'll just upgrade all our troop stuff. Your spell bonus bow from do is double this week in the week of magic. Okay. And it's the week of the elf. Okay, so interesting enough, there aren't that many more mines in our general vicinity. I think the best bet is I want to try and take down this um, air elemental. But I'm going to go via home because home will now have some more things to recruit. And hopefully we can build a altar of water and recruit one of those. And I thought I saw an altar of fire somewhere as well. Do I not have it yet? No, I do not have it yet. We need an altar of fire then, I suppose. And we'll just have a boatload of elementals, which is fine, I guess. Alright, before we do that, let's go in here. We'll build up the altar of fire. And we will recruit all of these as well. Oh boy, we have a lot of artifacts. Fair uh, A lot of... um. Elementals. Alright, cool. Send them over. Water, air, 
and pixies which will hopefully upgrade i don't know how that system is actually working but that's okay all right cool now if we don't have enough to beat this lots of air elementals at this point i'll be a little bit sad but we should be fine all right so we've got eight eight at seven seven and seven of the more powerful lightning elementals or storm elementals okay let's start by going out and trying to kill a couple of people oh i can build move again thank you very don't mind if i do all right move the elemental forward all right we've got more pixies they can go through and kill this this game is all about numbers game so see they just got annihilated because the numbers were higher It's also about trying to kill. As many different people as we can because. Oh, okay. I can use spells on these guys. Two centaurs perish. Wait, what? Two centaurs perish? Oh, that's because that. Cast air elemental. Cast air elemental. Air elementals. I don't know what that did. I apparently just cast air elemental on air elemental. It seems a little bit weird and counterproductive um let's see what spells have we gotten literally none of these are literally none of those spells i got are actually good for attacking okay lovely how about scuttle boat uf no none of these are actually good attacking spells i guess we got magic arrow still oh god this one's about to get wrecked let's try and even the playing field and fail dismally Oh, we do have. I don't think anyone really needs that much, do they? Oh, yes, pixies do. Okay. All right, let's start by trying to kill the three here, which we got. Very nice. The pixies can go back and kill a couple more, I hope. Ouch. We are losing quite a bit. This is why they like to. Uh, extend the stack sizes all right we'll do a ranged attack on not you apparently all right keep going you know what i don't like this guy very much oh god apparently they don't like me very much okay Save them. All right, let's heal the air elemental. Very nice. Okay. And try and take down the rest of this group. Perfect. Well, I say perfect, but... I do admit, this has been a lot more messy than I thought. Oh well. Thankfully, the medical tent will help. Perfection. And you can't do anything. Oops, I probably should have moved you slightly over. That's okay. Wait, did that just convert him to the other side? I hope not. If I just accidentally convert the other enemy, what did Fortune do? I thought Fortune was a good thing. They still seem to be on my side. Maybe this means they're full health. Oh good, you're still on my side. Okay, I was a little bit concerned there for a second when the color changed. Oh, it's been too long since I played. Okay, so we definitely killed more than they did, which is good. However, we lost all of our pixies and a few of our air elemental air elementals. Not as bad as I was expecting, though. So, honestly, we did all right. Yeah, I wonder... Health points, no, we're not sending him out in combat too often. 
Hmm. Let's go for some more magic at the moment. And advanced earth magic. Okay. Basic archery. Okay, well, the moment advanced earth magic makes more sense. Oh, good. You actually revived some air elementals. Or one air elemental. Garden of Revelation, which is good. A few things we can actually do. I was hoping we'd get a little bit further than this. Hmm. We are going to need... There's a bunch of stuff we need to work out how to do at the moment. It's been a while since we played, hasn't it? The Ogres, Pixies... Hmm. True Knowledge is plus one level. That's actually not too bad. I kind of want to unlock this, because that gives me an Earth Elemental Conflux, which means more units. As I said before, units are everything in this sort of game. I think I said that in um, Hero Hour, not here, but still. It's the same here. Alright. So we move forward. And we can kill the imp, first of all. We can move forward. Move forward. Oh yeah. No one's dead yet, so... I can heal your, your wounds a little bit, but quite frankly, I think you're good. Alright. Let's go for a... What did Fortune actually do? Increases luck by two. Okay. That's fine. Let's use this. Oh god, yes, that was effective. Okay, basic enemy enemies, not as much of a hard time as what we were facing before. Okay, but when you got two... Alright, that's fine, I guess. I actually don't want you to die, just in case I can use you and, re like, revive you. So I might just get you to go up here and not die. There we go, and... We are as close to done as we can be, by the looks of it. Oh, if I can just consistently keep raising that, I'd be happy enough. Like, can I, if I've got 16 now, do I get more than 16 at the end? Track casualties 10. Mm. Hope I do. Nope, 16 still, so no. It's not consistent. Right, expert sorcery or basic nobility? Go for expert sorcery for now. Alright, cool. Then we can go and grab ourselves a shrine shield of defense. Guess it's more defense, very nice. And of course, the conflux, which means. Oh, it's guarded by 19 earth elementals. That's not too bad. We can get this. Oh, wow, that's actually less than 19, but okay. Hmm, let's actually go for a magic arrow. There we go. Now you go behind him and do surprisingly low amounts of damage. Obviously, earth elementals are a little bit more powerful than I was expecting. Gotcha. Well, now I know these don't matter anymore. I think I will send this guy out to the closer to the front line. If you'll let me, excuse me. And heal our friend here back up to 16, I hope. Yes, indeed. And then they're dead. Fantastic. Although we apparently still lost 5. Somehow we started with 16. We still got 16, so I'm not entirely sure where we got that, but okay. We can definitely hire some Earth Elementals, though. Which is nice, because they seem very powerful. Beautiful. Alright, well, if that's the case, we should probably try and go around and get as many of these... Things as possible. I thought I saw another one before somewhere else, but um, it's good to have more. We also have explored up here, so we'll just explore up here and hopefully we'll find something of value. My letter tower, second level spell, goblins, they're not too strong. Stronger than me, probably, but still. Alright, let's see here. So, altar of earth, there we go. So now we can also get earth elementals ourselves, which is good. 
Because they seem pretty powerful before. Oh damn, all the elementals apparently. Okay, day four. Hmm. Knolls, etc. Okay. I think I'm going to work down here and maybe get this refugee camp if I can. If I can take down the ogres is the only problem. Or I can aim for something really nice and weak. Oh, sharpshooters would not go well for me, no. At the moment, we just want to build up our space as much as possible. We can start upgrading some of these things. Yep, upgrades our sprites. So sprites haven't been that useful. Let's upgrade our earth elementals first. Oh yeah, because now we get storm elementals. Very nice. Okay. If we send our troops back, do we get to upgrade them now? Alright, more upgrades. Now, can I like upgrade this? Yes, I can. I can upgrade the unit to Storm Elementals. Very nice. And I can upgrade these to Lava Magma Elementals. Very nice indeed. Okay. Very good. So, a little bit more powerful. Jeez, I probably should be able to take down these fairies, one would imagine. So, let's uh, try and take down these sprites. They're our lowest level troops. Oh yeah, those are weak. This is fine. So uh, we'll go in and start by using a magic arrow or not. Apparently we'll, we're still our spell points. Okay, every week we recover them. All right, so that will kill up to 35 and it's ranged. Oh, oh, it's so good, so good. Okay, these guys, I'm sorry guys, you have no chance against me right now. Air elemental, water elemental, elemental, elemental. Just wanna just want you to attack, to be honest. Yeah, whatever. Let's summon another air elemental then. And that air elemental is free and it can Okay, that was easy. That was very easy, and we get an extra level from it, which I'll definitely take. Get some more spell power. Then we get expert earth or basic wisdom. Okay, it allows me to learn third, third level spells, which is important because I do have some third level spells we need to unlock, so fair. Alright, sleep again. There we go. Day six, we're almost getting to the end of things. Upgrade the altar of water because we do still have some earth elementals we can upgrade. Some water elementals we can upgrade. There we go. We now got ice elementals. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Okay. Now, how much is in there? Probably two more than we can, can handle. Okay. All right. Let's go. I don't want to take down the staff suit just yet, but we're getting closer. I want to find a way to get free and explore. Maybe through here I can just explore already. Or we can take down these ogres. I think if we can handle the ogres, I don't know what level they are. I think they're higher than orcs though, so maybe not. Let's explore a little bit further out of the field. Oh yeah, we've got a lot of choices here of what we can attack. Boars are fairly weak. It does re re reveal us the learning stone and give us Africa sisters to the south here. So yeah, let's try and take down the boars. Alright, well, first things first. One to five boars. Oh, never mind, the boars aren't that weak. Okay. Let's just get rid of these guys as quick as possible. Okay, the boars will move forward, but they are in no way... Okay, no, you can't. Key, key. Where can you move exactly? Alright. You're the only one that gets healing, or needs healing right now. Okay. Ranged. Okay, boars aren't overly strong, but they're also not overly weak. So, let's try and take down this batch as quickly as possible. Keep some of your elementals. I'll take those three units. Very nice. Um, I think the one that needs help now is the water elemental, the ice elemental. Oh yeah, like that. Um, that range attack is fantastic. Okay, 
That one's finally dead. Beautiful. Lava elemental. Alright. We're fine. I think we're fine. There's no way they can really screw off us now, which is beautiful. Keep healing. Oh god, these are this is actually taking a while. Alright, we apparently lost 14 life elementals, but I think that that's the ones I summoned, because I definitely still have the same 16 I had before. So I feel like definitely these numbers are not fully representative, right? Alright, we got basic luck. Luck's always good. Earth magic though, oh, I do want to upgrade that. All right, and we've revived some magma elementals. Very nice. And we get our learning stone. It's this lovely chunk of this and allows us to explore further south. Walking dead is not too strong. That's okay. All right, keep going. Keep exploring. I must say, in comparison to Heroes Hour, I do like the Heroes Hour biomes pretty, like, a lot. They, that was a pretty cool system. I guess we'll see how long it takes for the enemy to come and wipe us off the face of the planet. <laughs> but um, I think, I don't remember that ha being so easy back then. Or did I just... Oh, select type of creatures. Maybe done once for other upgrading drawings. Okay, well, let's do the storm elementals. Sorry, you don't have enough resources to increase the one. Okay, but still, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool that we can upgrade it. Fair enough. We also got town gold reserve. Sorry, city hell must be built. We got recruit all available all available creatures. That's cool. I like that. All right, for now though, let's keep on upgrading these things. Wait, can we upgrade them again? <gasps> we can. I think that was one of the mods I selected to upgrade to three, but that's so crazy. We cannot build psychic elementals. Fire bird. Fire birds. I love it. I love it. I want to. I want to hire an army of phoenixes. Yes, please. All right. Special week. Got week of the archer, which isn't useful for us, but we can go back here. Grab ourselves some more troops, so we'll hire everything. Lost a bunch of money, but that's okay. We can throw them in there. And yes, we could... Oh, interesting. Oh, yes, yeah, because they're the ground, up, uh, ground elementals that got upgraded. That's fair. Oh, God, yes. Look at all our stuff. Oh, loving it. All right, so. Yes, increase our creature growth rate would be very useful. We are running out of money, though, so we are really having to, like, improve and go further afield shortly. So, let's recruit all those. Um, all right. We need more mines, or we need more stuff. Thinking, I really wish we could get past those sharpshooters. Maybe I can. Same as trogs and goblins and everything that way, but crusaders, they're not great either. Mm, okay. Problem is I forget the level of things. Let's go for these. I know they're pretty weak. In fact, so are these actually. Hmm. You're dropping a campfire. I forget what campfires do, so let's just clear out our territory a little bit. That's okay. So pixies, you can move forward. Storm Elementals, just take down the, the powerful guys. Good job. Alright, here they come. Like free unit. And we'll try and heal the pixies. Because the pixies, while weak, are pretty effective at one thing. Which is, you know, flying about and killing things, hopefully. Alright. Let's also see. We should have more ma more magic today. We do. Not much. But it should be still enough to send a magic arrow their way. If we can ideally... Lighten these guys out before they get a chance to attack us properly. We should be fairly nice. Oh, 
Okay, I don't like how quickly those pixies die. <laughs> I know why they're dying that fast, because it's pixies. But still. God damn it. Keep healing the pixies. Oh yeah, back up to basically max. Fantastic. Pixies, you can... We're lucky. Okay, that was dead. Probably should have sent that against the other guy. That's okay. See, the thing is, I do like it when games allow for suboptimal play. Because a game shouldn't be about make it, playing the game perfectly. That's what high difficulty should be for. If I wanted to worry about suboptimal play, I wouldn't be, um, well, I mean, I, I don't have time to, no one has time for that stuff, you know? Let's get a basic damage skill, maybe. Okay, we've got an ability or advanced first aid. Let's go basic and ability. This time around. All right, perfect. Okay, let's go for the dragonflies. Oh, damn. They went straight for the good stuff. They are actually a lot stronger than I remember. Oh, God. Sorry, I just wasn't expecting this level of pain from you. Oh great, a second attack. Oh yeah, I was not expecting these dragonflies to be this powerful. This is uh, not fantastic news. Um, free enemy, please. Uh, perfect. Alright, let's try and heal our fairies, though. Okay, fairy healing is actually going quite well. Ow, but then it undid itself entirely. Okay. Still no magic arrow ability. That's a shame. The more we use that, it should level up. Look, let's go and see if we can take down the goblins instead. It will probably still kill me, but... Oh, they did not. Okay. I thought you could do... I thought the Storm Elemental, you could do ranged attack. Have you been... You've probably been... Okay. It's because you're probably next to someone, so that probably won't work. That's just... Uh... There we go. Well, now you're not. Those dragonflies, though, god damn. Oh, no, don't kill all the pixies. I want to heal them. Alright, please heal the pixies. Thank you. Oh god damn, they really don't like the pixies, do they? Alright, well you should be able to attack range now again? No, you can't. Why can you not attack range? No melee penalty, protection from air, weakness. Oh, could that have caused it? Uh-oh. Alright, not bad. We're going to make it through this, but i got to say, this is um, taking a little bit more of my pain. Stuff than I expected, to be honest. Pixies. Okay, back to max. No, not for long. But damn, if the... If the if first aid tent is that effective, I'm surprised that um, we can't repair more. Oh god, yeah, that was a massacre. Oh, well, okay. That was a massacre. Oh, boy. Let's go for his basic speed skill, I guess. Logistics. Decreases your movement over land by 15%. Increase creature growth of one single town by 30% once a week. Uh, let's do that again. Alright, speaking of. 
Nothing else we can hire just yet. But we can probably build something. Get a marketplace, though I'm not entirely certain what good it will do when we don't have any real income at the moment. Wouldn't mind the Dwarven Treasury. Yeah, I believe those are pretty powerful too, but once again, I don't want to go against lizard men because they're all ranged. Let's go for trogs. Ah, perfect. All right, hundred. Oh god, that's a lot of that's a lot of dwarves. Let's uh, leave that for now. Okay, we're running out of places we can just explore. So we've already done a few things here, but that's okay. I wouldn't mind the shipyard. And 20, 20 to 49 mummies is probably a lot harder than it sounds, let's be honest. Oh yeah, those mummies look... Those mummies look... Bad. Oh! They also have a... Okay. They are bad. They are bad indeed. Okay. I'll try to avoid them getting in contact with the air elements. Apparently that stops them from remembering how to fire bullets or fire lightning bolts. Okay, well there goes our friendly neighborhood pixies already, which is lovely. Oh well. So going to be adequate ish killing things. Keep focusing on the weaker one if you can. Because the weaker one won't be able to retaliate as much either. Oh god, and Pixie's dead. Well, that is disappointment. Not unexpected, though. Fortunately, we can't heal the pixies now, so... Pretty sure we can't heal very many people at all, because, yeah, they've almost... Okay. I think that's the wrong one. Oh, well. Go for the weak one. Damn, that one didn't even heal anything. Okay, if we get this done, then we can actually explore a little bit of the ocean, which would be nice. Oh god, they really... love to damage me. We shouldn't have healed that one, but that's okay. Oh yeah, we did not do well. I mean, we did it, so that's good, but we didn't do fantastically. Advanced first aid is probably the way to go, to be honest. After that, I would definitely like to buy a boat. Also, let's see if you guys have anything I can build here. Sure. They need one right now, but that's okay. Spell power. Alright, so when we're on the boat, we can explore on the water and go who knows where, to be honest. Hopefully to a place with lots more mines, because we've found like two so far. Oh, I swear, if this is... If this is just like a tiny, tiny, like... Skerrick of water, like a lake or something... My character's going to be quite disappointed by this um, turn of events. Oh, it, are you really going to be just this little tiny section here? Because I, I know it's the edge of the map, but come on, come on. Don't, don't do this to me, game.
Okay, it does feel like there is... Okay, we can go somewhere else. Although, only to fight some centaurs. Um, or some centaur captains. Honestly, neither of those sound like a fantastic job for me right now. So, I'm going to gather resources so we can actually continue to build stuff up. Okay, wood elves. More spell power. Oh. We get a dog. Very nice. I guess. Um, I'm getting around the back of you, so that's fine. Okay, I'm glad it's a little bit larger than I thought it was going to be, but that's okay. So... Still actually have plenty more to equip, apparently. So we are we are mighty low on gold right now. Oh well, we found some here, so that's something. In fact, that leprechaun thing, if we can take that, which it looks like we can. Gems. Okay, that's okay. It's okay. Whatever works, to be honest. Aha. Uh -huh. Star axis. And more leprechauns. Hey, if they're the mines they want to give me. I'll take it, but um, wasn't exactly what I was expecting. The thing is, um, the one thing I find about this game is that the lowest level mobs often still end up being very powerful, just due to the fact of how many you get, right? So, as much as I want to like donate them to make them peons, for example, I feel like the actual effect of that may not be as positive as, uh, as I'm thinking. Ooh, that would be some very... I would love to get to that Alchemist Lab and get some, uh, some Mercury. Alright, keep hiring. We will send someone back eventually. Although, wait. How do I do this? Like, how do I make them into... Peons. I did see that before somewhere, but maybe not. Oh, I think I turned it off, actually. I, I tried this very briefly before, just to get a chance to say, and I was like, wait, no, I should probably record this. Ooh, now that's interesting. Oh, hello, a magic lantern. That means genies are... Oh, that's it's pixies, I think. Yeah, because that's what the pixies come from, right? Magic lanterns. Yeah, sprites. So that's nice. All right, let's... um. Didn't you to hire? Oh, damn. Who thought it takes so long to hire everyone in town? Yes. Oh, cool. You just hire them, too. There's no, no like, convoluted thing to this. Ooh, fire metal, elemental conflux. That would not be bad either. All of magic. Very nice. I might try and take down these imps here. Well, first aid, honestly. We're losing so many people in combat. It's not funny. Ooh, upgrade enemy. Upgrade enemy, though not to fight that many water elementals do so. I think we've actually hired everyone by the looks of it. Yep, everyone's hired. So we've got a nice big army ready to come back to, which is nice. Probably have more by the time we actually get back. Alright, let's try. Okay, this is just one giant stack. These guys are going to fly first, so I think what I'll do is, I'm going to... I've got spells, so I'm just going to use Magic Arrow. Are they ranged, or are they... I forget if they're ranged, or melee. I have a feeling they are melee, so... I'm going to take a gamble here and just wait on all these enemies. If we can, like... 
Okay, you go ahead. You go a little bit ahead, but like, the idea is I want you to protect the other troops. Okay, is that for you? You can just go forward. He hasn't actually moved yet. Keep waiting. If we can kill this guy without him moving, I would take that as a massive win. Okay, no. He's definitely moving. Well, still, let's just hold up a little bit. We can hire some more elementals, for example. Oh, I think the... think this... Oh... I wonder if the magma elementals turn into stone elementals. I didn't even see where that one came from. I still don't know exactly. Okay. Did they downgrade themselves over time when they get less hot? I don't know. This one's a freebie, so it can go. Pixies, sure. Okay. We didn't lose very many people all that time, I think. Beautiful. So we just get a free um, thing. We know the imps are now good for us to go for, which is nice. Wouldn't mind taking down the zombies there. Zombies are not that powerful. No, good. Perfect. And now we have a windmill, which is a mine. Fantastic. So now we're finally producing a little bit of extra food. All right. Let's go back. Purely so we can upgrade our army and get more troops next week. Ooh. Ultra of Thought, Psychic Elementals. Okay, let's uh, hire some more Psychic Elementals. Only three growth, but that's okay. Let's just uh, hire you guys if we can. Ah, apparently we cannot have fought them. Understandable, they are our, apparently our dragon alternatives is their last one in the group. All right, locust. All dwellings increase their population. Oof, okay. All right, let's go here and hire. All of those guys, or as well as we can. Hire everyone else if we can. Okay, fantastic. I say fantastic, but we definitely need more gold income. Now, I'd love to get to the underground too. I'm a little bit concerned that I don't have access to the underground. Because I would very much like it. See, this game is still good. <laughs> I'm still having a blast. Alright, let's get some... Ooh, nobility. Thanks to your presence in the crown, there are troops available to recruit immediately? Do I get them for free? Nope, don't get them for free. Okay. Yes, every week you've got to come back home because apparently people love you. All right. Beautiful. Well, we still got plenty to recruit this week, so we might as well stay close. But I think at this point we've actually got an army that's capable of doing some serious damage to some of these creatures. Let's try, for example, there was a windmill I saw somewhere around here. Windmill up here. Oh, they're still made though to range, guys. You know what? We need to be... I want to... I kind of want to see if I can get through this um, garrison. Oh dear, that garrison does look powerful. I will give them that much. And in fact, they're all ranged troops. is a little bit concerning. Okay. Speaking of range, though, let's start killing them. Speaking of... Speaking of... 
A garrison, powerful enchantment that expresses a lot of magic. Well, that's not great. Alright, kill the... Oh god, the, yeah, I definitely have never seen those those elementals before. Gotcha. The rest of them I think I've seen as regular troops before, but yeah, this is... The Conflux is definitely a brand new um, one for this mod. The Pixies aren't, but everything else is. And the Pixies dead now. Good job, guys. I'm actually quite proud of you for going for the Pixies first, because now I can't heal them. Fact. I don't think I can heal anything. Oh god. Okay. Let's try and get rid of entire batches if we can. Ooh, we can't actually get further forward. It's a little concerning. Wow, this is a really impactive, if, if effective garrison. What the hell? No wonder they want to take down the... Okay, no wonder they want to take down what they did, you know? Oh boy. Okay. Thankfully only one turn of that. Maybe it alternates, so we better be quick, just in case. Although, now we just block that off. Ugh, okay. We just get in a slightly better order so I can send people forward to actually do some damage, like that. Everyone, move in, please, before they reactivate their shield. Um... Heal you, because you're at the front lines. Okay, shield is back up. That's okay, though. Move closer. Move closer. Amazing, this shield was not activated because we had someone on it, so that's good. Get out of the way for next turn. Okay, you can just wait for now. You can also just wait. You, however, can heal. Okay. Continue to wait, I suppose. Okay. They're dead. This is fine. Oh, yeah. Very nice. We lost all our pixies, but everything else is fine. And we got all our ice elementals back, which is fantastic. And we can now put some things in garrison, but at the moment, probably not important. I do like that we can do that, though, so we'll have to consider that later. Okay, rogues, horn demons. Neither of these are really fantastic. I would love to get the elemental conflux. I think at the moment we should head back, though, and grab from this one. God damn, we still cannot afford everything. In fact, we're still very far off affording anything major. Yeah, we could probably take down the dwarves against the dwarven ter treasury. Or we could probably take down this, these ice, these elementals here. Oh yeah, they don't even have their powerful versions. Don't get me wrong. They're very strong, but uh, at the moment, so are we in comparison. I gotta say, we are losing some serious troops. Oh, come on. Why even show it that high if it can't go that far? Aha, uh -huh, look at that. Those two Earth Elementals did indeed start spawn when these guys were killed. So obviously, when they die, they, they go and turn to regular Elementals, which is fascinating. Cast from Earth on Earth Elementals. Wait, can I just... Oh! They've got a buff as well. So they can buff their own corpses. 
Good job, guys. Wait, can I then revive them? Apparently so. So many elementals. Oh, never mind. Le slightly less elementals. Oh damn, this is actually taking a surprisingly large amount of time. Oh damn. In fact, I don't think I can even heal anyone. Oh, you, okay. Oh, don't go for Storm Elementals, please. I need those. You're not even gonna be alive for much longer. Can't you just let me have this this victory? Oh god, that was not that was not a good trade. Ooh, basic estates. 250 um, gold per day to your cause. Yes, I need that. Although wisdom, 4th level spells. That's okay, I don't Alright, we've got some Storm Elementals back and we get to go to the temple, the, the tower over here now. Alright, defense up by one. Feels mildly underwhelming given what we lost. Oh well. On to the goblins. See, this is why I like this sort of game. Like, you get to explore and you get to slowly, like, get more powerful over time. The numbers get larger. Always a good, always a winner. Wait. What? Since when have you been able to do ranged attacks as well? If I knew that, you would not have been in the front line. Who else can do ranged attacks? Obviously you. Okay, so apparently the ice elemental can also do ranged attacks, which is something I did not know before. Fantastic. Alright. We got Ice Bolt. Well, that might be useful. Yeah. I mean, we're doing okay at clearing our own territory. There's definitely still some things I'd like to get my head towards, but, you know. Like, you can probably stay here for a bit. Okay, yes. The pixies I need in larger numbers. So if I can't have them in large numbers, there's not much point. So I've got to say, oof, we have a lot of things that we can't necessarily afford yet. Alright, day six. Oops. Excuse me. All right. Uh, let's see here. Let's go down and try these sharpshooters. It's the only real way we can get a new area to explore. Oh, I just know you guys are all ranged as well. Oh god, you are not just ranged. You guys are kicking ass. They are weak though, if we, if we get close to them, we should be alright. Just checking. We also need to heal our good guys fairly quickly. These guys here, the Psychic Elemental, needs to be healed at all costs.
Oh, so is everything though, so... Like, holy hell, these guys are wrecking my face. How are you so powerful? Oh boy. And, 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 okay. I'm full of magical energy. Wait, how are you back? We already killed the halflings. Okay. Five him. Okay, good. Even when he fights back, he does with style. Ow, oh, damn it. Of course they level up. I'm killing my most powerful beasts. Okay, we're getting there, but seriously. Where are my Storm Elementals? I had way more than one of you before. More Storm Elementals, please. Wait, what? Oh no. Have they been dead for too long? Probably. Everything else is dead. God damn, that was hard. Thanks, I guess. Wisdom, please. I probably need it after that fight. Alright. So, our puzzle map is slightly a little bit more nice to you there. Not really. Not really at all, actually. Yes. Ooh, we also got the Crown of the Supreme Magi. So if we look in our inventory, we now have on the Warden the Head increases your knowledge skill by 4. That's pretty good. And Critical Spell Chance by 6%. Also increases the damage of Ice Bolt and Frost Ring. So I'll need to make sure you use Ice Bolt. Okay. Sounds good to me. Priest of Light. Lord Axe's Ferocity. So, mm, very nice. Okay explore a little bit more and hope we can actually find some stuff that doesn't require us to kill more creatures oh no last time I fought those dragonflies it did not go well well it didn't unlock as much as I was hoping maybe it's time to keep going on the boat and keep hiring We should go back and, and get a re increased amount of people if we can before that happens, but ouch. Yes, yes, we get a squirrel. This is um fine. Oh boy, we uh unfortunately definitely do not have a massive swarm of enemies uh, to people keep. Oh well, we'll keep hiring as we explore. If we get lucky, we can maybe get another town. That would increase our gold income. And of course, we've got plenty of things we want to unlock. So, let's just go back to our boat. Which I can get to in one go. And we can move up to north. Find another, another place, an like underground link or something. There should be stuff up here. So... Okay, we got what appears to be a jungle territory here. Might as well land for a little bit. I need a second hero, actually. You know, that would probably not be a bad idea. Let me get the money for it, at least. We didn't have a... I didn't even think we have a tavern. I don't even know if we can... Oh, yeah, we do have a tavern. It's the thing that looks like that. Alright, planeswalker or wizard. Mm, kind of both look kind of eh. You know what? No, let's upgrade my altar of fire. Increases to energy elementals. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Mm. 
moment we just need to explore. We got the map. The map is so big. The chances of actually coming across the enemy anytime soon are pretty small. And it hasn't been 50 days yet or 100 days yet. So we got plenty of time before they become more than a, more, more a threat. Thankfully. Because otherwise, oof. Because I always have much more fun with this. Ooh, poison. Damage plus magic power. Extra skill appears she has damage and man power master skills. Okay, I will do that then. Basic mysticism. Ooh, re regenerates maximum spell points per day. Oh, both of those are really good. Let's go for basic mysticism though, because we've been sort of doubling down spells with no ability to cast them. Sure. Oh god, no. So after many hours of long, dark, twisty passages, you find yourself in a cave with no other way to go but there you came. Suddenly from the back of the cave comes a fearsome beast and killing you. Nope. I wonder if we can go back in there. There's no way I could kill that blood dragon. Or more accurately, a swarm of blood dragons because it wouldn't just be one blood dragon. I know we can actually explore it still. Okay, so we can come back to that later. Fantastic. Keep hiring. Oh, hello. Spell power. Thank you, scholar. We've got pixies. Not we can do much in the Griffin Conservatory. We've got some gnolls. We could take down gnolls, but not right now. All right, all my troops are blessed, which is fantastic. And, oh yes, magic elemental growth plus five. That is fantastic for me, given that my entire empire is elementals. Though, gotta say, it's uh, gonna take a bit, yes. We need to hire them all, which is a... We, I mean, we only get like a thousand gold, which is why it's so, it would have been so important to get that other one, but I think the mysticism makes more sense, you know? It's okay. If we train too much and this guy's still far away, we'll just get a second hero. Otherwise, we'll wait till he gets back. It should be fine regardless of what we choose, but, uh... Ooh, spell scroll. And we've also got... Another defense boost. Cyclops stockpile. Okay. Ah, stables. That's useful. Honestly, probably a good thing that we feel safe anywhere. Imp cache, iron golems. Ooh, yes, another free mystical gun. Very nice. Oh, yeah, this place is fantastic. Oh, it's even got another mine. Yes, please. I'll take the mine. And some exploration. Our resources are going pretty well. We got plenty of, um, you know, pressure probably wouldn't mind the archer, but no, for now. Ooh, a war machine factory. Marksman. All right. Those lizard men are going to kill us if we try to take them. For now, let's keep on exploring. I think I see another mine to the south. So I missed this water wheel. Oh, yes. Really bring you gold. And ooh, look at that. It's another town, and it's a human town. It has, however, got a lot of defenders, but, you know, it's good to have a second town, as I said before. For now, though, let's just see what we can afford to do. We can upgrade the, the Altar of Thought. Yeah, let's upgrade the Altar of Thought. And then, can we actually upgrade our... Oh, no, I actually want to... Oh, no, I want to put those back together. Sorry. Sorry, wrong button. All right, there we go. We now have those, and now we can 
high the rest, I hope. Well, some of, some things, I guess. All right, now, more importantly, we now have the Altar of Thought upgraded, which is fantastic news. Nothing we can really do right now, but, um, yeah, that seems good to me. Oh, yeah, I was going to sell some resources. That's what I was about to say. I could sell some of this um, wood, if I think about it properly. Get the ore, get that. A crypt. That has a fight in it, I believe. Wow, this area is great. Pandora's box. Hmm. Let's keep exploring for now and get a good lay of the land and decide what we actually want to try and focus on. At the moment, there's just resources everywhere, which is fantastic. Storm elementals, that's a no. Okay. This part is fantastic. And the fact it's got another town somewhere so close is beautiful. Alright, let's go to the market. Which is here. And we shall trade to gold. Really? Oh, that's how cheap it is. Okay, fair enough. Let's trade a little bit in for gold then. How about that? This also 25. That's 50. That's 50. Oof, gold is a lot more expensive than I expected. Okay. I guess it is the most important resource for a reason. Because we need it to hire more people. Resource silo. Yes. Additional resources per day. I will take that. Alright. Expert earth magic and more power. Well, hello, mercenary camp. Taxville? Still? Yes, please. Got another spell. We got another this. Now, can I destroy this is the question. Probably not. I think I've got to go head back and get some more resource, uh, more, more troops. I'll explore this area to its entirety. Then I'll go back, get some more troops. And by the time I get back here, I should have plenty to take them back. Take them down, I think. Actually, City Hall, that increases my maximum gold increase by a lot. So let's do that. Always invest in future gains. Honestly, I kind of want money at the moment. <laughs> All right, more spell power. Very nice. Ooh, that's another artifact. Infinite gems also works in backpack. Oh, cornucopia. Ring increases your gem production by one. But arch magi? Oof. Not not yet. Keep exploring for now. When we come back with our reinforcements though, that's uh, not a bad idea. For now, money. All the money. We need a lot more money. We're running low on money. Like, seriously. Low on it. Give me it all. Give me every bit of money you have. So I kind of notice the game is running a little bit slow in its animations. I guess because it's a large map, but still. It's okay. The game itself isn't running poorly, so. It's got a lot to hire, though. And Thankfully, though, we should be making a fair chunk per day. Not to mention we're finding a bunch, too. Okay, Marksman, we already had them wreck a school of war. Now that sounds good. A tax skill, probably. A well. Sure. Nope, Spring Angels. Pixies? Pixies we could probably take down, and honestly, it's probably worth it for another windmill. So, alright. Worst case scenario, we lose and we have to hire someone else, which I hope we don't have to do, because that would be terrible. On the plus side, at least we know that this general vicinity is safe and quite good for expansion. So that is nice. Let's start, because we now know we can actually cast a spell. We know our Ice Bolt is more powerful nowadays. So, oh god, it is a lot more powerful. Oh yes. Oh yes, yes, yes. That was nice. We saw the pixies, though. 
It's not nice. It's just powerful. Oh god. I know we only need a couple of those things, but still. Alright, free troops, free upgrades, and then we can get an upgrade, a repair here. Something tells me the pixies won't survive. Mine or theirs. Low level units. They know how to they know how to cause damage, what can I say? Alright, Storm Elemental's repaired, that's fine. Ooh, this one produces, um, something else other than gold. Okay. Alright, where do we want to go? I guess, I don't want to take the lizard men, but it should be re relatively easy. Alright. There are more pixies there, but no. Let's uh, keep walking around. Keep hiring, please. Goblins, goblins everywhere, but not a drop to drink. That's okay. Alright, let's head back and use Let's head back, get to our ship if we can and then transfer over our massive new army because quite frankly this, this army is becoming quite good now. That's the point where I definitely want a second one. Nothing special this week. Bad luck. Sometimes falls near enemies in combat, causing their de their attacks on you half damage. Oh, okay. Only on your enemies? Weak of the Bumblebee? I am on board with that one, yes. Alright. Oh, damn, we can't get all the way back. That's a shame. Oh, well. Take a couple of days means more money. We can get more, more stuff we can get in our coffers, so... And more coffers means more army, so... They take us a few days to get back home. But it just means a larger army in the end. Alright. So, what have we got here? We've got some magma elementals. We've got some energy elementals. We have to upgrade these guys, so stop doing that. That wasn't what I was trying to do, and you don't know it because you're a game. Oh. Don't have money. Let's send you all back then, for now. And put you forward, put you forward. There we go. It's not perfect, but it'll do. Two more, in two more types of things we get as well. Um, all right, we're fine. Oh, yeah, it's a storm element, so we still need to hire in that with some guy. Okay, we just want to head back out again. I guess so. There's no reason to stay. That being said, we can probably start building some more stuff around here as well. Do I want to? I'd rather take that town over. Yeah, let's go take that town over if we can. We got. As many troops as we can possibly have afforded. I won't say possibly asked for, but possibly afforded. Alright. Also try and swim all the way up the sh shoreline. So swim. Uh, boat all the way up the shoreline. Try and get closer to it as well. Very, ooh, hello. Never mind, might come here because that's a lot of spells. All right. 
right. Keep hiring. But also build a pyre. You yeah, build a pyre. Definitely build a pyre. Definitely build a pyre. I want to see what... Oh, look at him. Oh, what a cutie. How much is it to upgrade the pyre? Not too much. It's 15k. That's actually quite, quite a fair amount. I bet I want better birds, so... Upgrade my birds to better birds. No, don't mind if I do. Alright. We finally whooped our way around and we're about to hopefully capture a Cuban village. Hopefully. Oh boy. This is not going to be... This is not going to be easy, is it? I don't even think... No, no we can do this, but... Um, well... We can't kill any angels, we can kill some griffins. I should probably also use a spell, like the Ice Bolt. It kills one of the angels, great. 15 of them, that's alright, three of those. Go for the 15. More numbers, more better, alright? Ow, ow. Okay, there's not that many of you left, so... Uh-oh. Can you do... Hmm. Oh, well. Guess she's going to go... Oh, nice move. Right, let's also use another spell, because we should have plenty. Let's try and take down these archers. They're not very strong, but... Um, they are going to be doing damage from us that we can't really block or do anything about. things we can't block or do much about those angels are pretty powerful oh god yes pikeman no a free unit good idea the free unit can take down these guys if possible If we can take both of them at once, that would be definitely a preference. Actually, spell, ice bolt. Let's take down this guy as well. Weaker enemies aren't as big of a threat technically, but numbers are king. If you take down numbers, take down armies. Which, granted, is what they're also doing to me, so... Like if we can take this, if we can take this town, we get a lot from it. Oh shoot! Didn't know that you were so close to death. I do appreciate that. Oh no, they are also dead. Okay. Let's keep. Okay, we really need to do something more powerful than a second level spell. We've got a third level lightning bolt. We got a ring. It's third level. I don't think we can afford 4th level yet, so let's go for a 3rd level Lightning Bolt. That kills 2 of those. Alright, let's go. Oh, that actually killed 3. Ooh, and this has a chance to kill the Angel in general. It did not. This will. Okay. Use some range. I don't know who else to heal. I think you probably have lost a fair chunk. Oh no! They actually, they actually destroyed it. Oh, that free healing. I loved it so much. Let's use another spell, please. Um, let's use lightning bolt on... You. Eeny, meeny, miny, dead. Okay, look, this is still worth it. As long as the enemy doesn't come and... As long as the AI doesn't come, like, right at this moment, having a second town is killer. Like, it means double everything, basically. God, was that worth it? Mm, I hope so. 
Okay, basic logistics or expert wisdom. Obviously, expert wisdom, fifth level spells, very important. And now we have a town, which we can straight away, of course, build a fort in. So this will definitely mean we want a second hero, because we want a hero that does this and a hero that does that. That being said, it'll probably take a while to actually have that town be worth using. It's not going to just happen overnight. And we should definitely head back and get those fifth level spells. Alright. Well, that was painful, but I think it was worth it. More money through taxes, I hope. Do we have a ta do we have a tavern here? We do have a tavern now, at least. All right, so we can get elementalist or a barbarian. Honestly, <laughs> elementalist sounds kind of funny, really, but I kind of want something that can just do some serious damage. Let's get the barbarian. Oh shit, the barbarian is definitely not our same type. Okay, never mind. I should have probably. I mean, neither of them are actually the right time, but that's okay. That's okay. We just have a second hero, and that one can use the humans, even if they're not going to use it right now. That's okay. Everything's fine. You're going to be waiting around a little bit anyway, because I'm not going to be... Oh, I can send you around some places. I just will need a second boat for you, because you'll need to explore separately from this girl. So now I have a hero, so... Fantastic. Will he join the army too? Fantastic. That is actually brilliant. Wait, what? Um. Huh. Okay, I like basic... I like basic scouting, I've decided. I don't remember it ever doing that in the old game, but I'll take it. Oh, well, that's the case. Let's just... Oh, damn. Just getting powered after power after power. And you can continue to explore because, quite frankly, it does feel like you're quite a good explorer. So at the moment, you just want to go around and get all the stuff that the other hero has already unlocked for you. Now, this place is becoming a point where it's not going to be as profitable to actually build you up. Hmm. Then again, that would also increase the, the power of magic by this other lady. I think this one though is the one that we've got tons to improve, so we should be able to do anything there. Rather the sword increases to morale by two during a siege, okay. Or marketplace. Trade rates increase for each arc your own. Okay, so that means we'll get more money for our market transactions, which is good because we've still got plenty of ore and plenty of um, wood. Alright. So we can sort of almost recuperate some of our troops, maybe a little bit, not much. I admit this is kind of a pathetic offering, but that's okay. At least we've got birds now, even though I was going to wait till the upgrade, but completely decide to change that mind. All right, I think the best bet for her then is going to be keep exploring and finding other lands. And this lady will be all about leveling up this hero here. Oh yeah, more free elementals. You're going to have to go back to the other area pretty soon because I'm going to want you to drop those elementals off on the other guys. Alright, let's um, move you back down here now, I suppose. Yeah, I really want to upgrade this town hall. So let's try and save for that.
Okay, I gotta admit, humanity is um, going to take a while longer to to get a level up than I expected. But start with Town Hall. And obviously this one won't be able to afford anything specifically, but I can probably yeah, get a couple more troops at least. Oh, that's actually saying only 100 to 100. I could have probably taken that. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, now, it should be said occasionally things do, like, recuperate. So, yes. Something to keep in mind. Alright. Citadel upgrade. Increase the future growth. Mage... You know, Mage Guild would not be bad because we do have a lot of... No, no. Let's just get upgrade Archer Tower. And start actually being able to train some troops here as well, very shortly. Though I don't think we'll ever be able to afford all the troops at once, which is annoying. Improve your gold reserve. Oh, I can improve my gold reserve now. Obviously, I got what I need. Okay, well, I need to do that too. I have to invest gold to get more gold. I mean, I like that, that those odds, so let's do that. Yes. Um, I've got the five. You don't have enough resources to improve your gold reserve. Now I need 5,000. Okay, that's okay. I thought it was only 1,000, but okay. Obviously, at the moment, it must take a little bit of time. So, yeah. Bang. 5,000 to increase by 1,000. 5,000 to increase by another 5,000. That's okay. That's reasonable. Um, well, how many times I increase my gold reserves then? I will take it. Because gold is clearly something I really do need. All right, you can keep exploring. She's doing the, um, I'm fine with not fighting them, actually. All right, Archer's Tower. Ooh, actually, now the Archer's Tower is probably more worth it. And this one character will end up having some archers, so, yeah, let's recruit all of the archers. Well, all the ones we can actually afford, apparently. You wait another day for that. That's okay. Oh, we could wait a little bit longer and get 5,000 gold. Ooh, obelisk. Shame we can't get to it because of those trogs, so I probably could kill the trogs. Okay, we've got enough for another upgrade of our beautiful gold reserve. There we go. All right, there we go. I'm surprised it's still so cheap, but I guess it's a mithril, which we only get in very small quantities. And as long as we don't need the mithril for anything else, though, that should be okay with me. All right, let's explore. Let's keep going. Oh, I, I didn't. I saw I miss you. Learn cure. Yes, please. I did miss you. I feel like we walked directly past you. Yes. Stable. Probably should visit with the other character too, but that's okay. We weren't going that way. I go visit once a week. I, I know. I know. It's it's fine. Everything's fine. No one said we have to be perfect, except all the people who say we have to be perfect. In society. Who cares about society, though? Psh. All right, is this a desert area? No, does, probably not, but it had the right color for a few seconds there. Oh, damn. Hmm. Problem is, I can't necessarily destroy these storm elementals. At least not what I've currently got, so I might actually need to um, lend my boat from this character to this character which isn't a bad idea actually because then I can go and pick up some um, more stuff around here so yeah I think I'll lend the boat to this character so they can get across uh, and then this character can if we teleport that would be nice but I don't think we've got that ability yet all right keep upgrading the gold reserves apparently we can still afford it I'll take it Are they separate gold reserves too? They are separate gold reserves. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. They're separate gold reserves. Which does of course mean that this character this um this particular city is becoming increasingly more valuable. 
and increasingly like a city I do not want them to be able to take. You can just wait there. Once again, I'm not actually planning on seeing the AI anytime soon. I'm sure that's how this game works. Because I like the player to the um player versus environment of this game. The game lo loads okay, let's get the Mages Guild. So we've got very similar spells to the other place, which is a shame. Okay, so we've got enough that we can increase it further. Okay, we can do that twice more. Alright, there we go. Look at that. 9,000 gold. Oh, yes. That is good. That is good stuff right there. Alright. Can we also increase the Mage's Guild again? Alright, we can go inside. We get some spell research, spell firewall, we get visions, we get ice bolt again, which we already had. Okay. Alright, this is fine. We've still got money where we could probably upgrade this again. Oh, it is actually increasing in price now. Okay, so this is when it starts increasing in price. That is fine though, because honestly. This will help a lot more than we had before, so I'm okay with this. Now, we can probably do some more combat. And there is an artifact, like, right there. Oh, I like that one. We're just talking about how I want that, but dendroid soldiers. I also want that, though, the Pandora's box. This could sounds interesting. Hmm. Honestly, those frongs are also are increasing in, 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 in stuff every so often, so. It's okay. It's okay. I want you to go back and buy your own ship from down here. That's what I want you to do. So you want to go all the way back here. Yes, of course. Oh, wait, fight them. No, no, no. I thought you meant uh, you want them in your army. You asked a few times there. Alright, well, we got a little bit of time in this territory. Kind of want to see if I can take down... That's a lot of imps. In fact, honestly, the enemies are growing faster than we are currently. Which is concerning, but exactly what I wanted in general. I think I might try and take down this crypt. That might be a good idea. Alright, recruit the maximum, because we can afford it, because we're worth it. And we can definitely not afford to upgrade that again, which is okay. First of all, you can go back still, and hopefully next turn you'll be able to buy a new boat. Not that it'll be a help very much, because you still need to take the other boat back. So until you, someone gets teleportation, we're kind of screwed. Oh, that seems like a lot. You know what? Screw it. Let's go. Okay, they are also all around us, which is a little concerning. But that's okay. We can use Lightning Bolt. Take down something. 33, 36. That won't kill the Medusa. That's a little bit concerning. How powerful is that Medusa? I'll kill all the rights, though. <sighs> Numbers are everything. Magic bolt weak, extra charge. Oh, that's okay. Oh god, they completely annihilated me. Oh, damn. 
Never mind, I've been targeting the wrong person. I should have killed that other one. Okay, let's do that right now. It said magic bolt. We don't have magic bolt. We've only got magic arrow. That's okay. Lightning bolt. Kill it. At least do some damage to it. Oh god, apparently no. Can't even do damage to it. Okay. It is doing damage more than we can, so let's stay away from it. Oh boy. Oh wow. My own troop killed my own troop. Very good. Very nice. Just what I wanted in life, really. Uh oh. Lightning bolt again. Please kill it this time. Oh god, your health is down to only 50, so you will die soon, but seriously. Ouch. Hoot. So we'll die, but we are going to need to go back and recuperate our, our forces as soon as possible. You know what we should have done? We probably... How are you still alive? You only had 50 health left before. How are you still alive? Health left, 472. Okay, never mind, I was misreading that. Can we just get another lightning bolt on this thing? And just... Oh, thank fudge, it's gone. But so is everyone else. Uh-oh. This isn't great. In fact, we might almost want to move this guy away. Because otherwise, if, if everyone dies and I can't... If we cast more spells, we might still have a chance. But if everyone dies, this is not good. We still got plenty. I, we got 28 spell points left. God damn, we do not have plenty of spell points left. Kills all 19. Thank you. Alright, so what do we have left? 10 spell points. We use a regular magic arrow. Spell effect, no one. Lovely. Okay. Um, ice points. Nope, that's not going to work. Uh, do we have anything that we can actually cast? with 10 points just magic arrows magic arrow flame nope um magic arrow nope okay no magic arrows will actually hit everyone okay this is concerning i'm not gonna lie oh boy okay it needs to get close to me and i need to be the one that makes the first shot Okay. Somehow we... Well, we didn't survive. I was going to say somehow we survived, but no. Because that was a temporary troop, it failed. Uh, can we even hire our person back? Nope, not yet. Maybe we have to wait a turn or so. Damn it! <laughs> well, that was anticlimactic, wasn't it? Oh well. See, unlike the other game, I actually feel like we can make some mistakes without it being an instant death sentence. Now, has anyone has, has they gone back yet? No. Oh wait, here we go. First. So they have more heroes. They have more gold. I have more wooden ore. And they have more numbers of towns. The best hero is crappy, because Kilgore just died. Okay, because my main guy just died. Okay. That's fine. There's got to be a way to revive, though. Mm, maybe not here. For now, let's just keep hiring people. As much as I don't want to, we might be forced to... A planeswalker does sound like at least our, our genre of music, right? It sounds like our type of hero. So, let's try and hire that planeswalker. 
Or we can wait a week. If we wait a week, I think it changes and we've got a chance that something good happening. Hmm. Build another boat. Keep learning all the spells. Pass back the uh, elemental you don't need. So, we don't want this one and we don't need this one. I still do want this one to be a human hero eventually, I have to say. So for now, we're fine. However, you've got a lot of work to do before anything happens. A second term, a second um, town is very important though, so at least we've beelined to that. Oh, nice. Okay, let's just wait the week out and see if the heroes change. Ideally, I want to hire back my old hero, but I don't know if I can. I remember it being a concept, but I don't remember ever actually doing it. Best thing is, we did actually get through this. We just didn't finish it. So it says visitors, but we never actually got the reward for it, which is... More than a little concerning, considering. Oh well, let's try and head on. Oh, it's still more to learn, apparently, down here. Oops. Okay. One more day, then we get to see what new heroes are like. If it's one of our old ones, that'll be nice, but I don't know. All right. You can then take your boat and go back up here to recuperate your own strength because now you can start getting troops from here, I reckon. Wood and all. Fantastic. I know I've already got a fair number of those, but that's okay. Alright, let's see the, the thing here. Elementalist or cleric. God damn it. What do you have? You have elementals? Guess what? You are our new hero. Congratulations, Grendon. Also, can we upgrade your troops? Fantastic. Can we upgrade these troops as well? Yes, we can. Okay. Move everything here. Fantastic. Fantastic. Okay. It's not perfect, but we it's much more powerful than the other character ever was. We just need to get back the... Um, Get back the experience that we had before, but uh, and we can probably do that just by milling around here for long enough and um, getting our money as expected. Um, hmm, four thousand gold per day that's pretty good, but not as good as what we have through the other thing. So, hmm, okay. Well, first of all, let's go see if we can grab some more. Okay, we can't because we don't have the space for them, and there's only four of them anyway, so. Yes, let's go and explore and try and get to all the power-up places we did before. And then you'll be able to fight after that. I mean, you already have a larger army than anyone here does, so... And if I was to choose... Look at our tower. Okay. Not sure where it was seeing that, but okay. Very nice. More archers. I will take that. Okay, I've decided scouting is very powerful. Yes, I need to get scouting on all my characters if possible. We're actually almost um, getting through the full hiring process. Fantastic, we just need to have a hold of a few more interviews. Anyone wants to join my army? Well, um... We've got a great track record. We've only lost one hero in our entire lifespan. Thane's level 7 our alchemist. The 
one artifact. I wonder if that's one of his. One of the other guys. So you'll definitely have more heroes than I will. So. Ah, that's what we're seeing. We're seeing the fact it was a tower. Okay, so, new plan. Silver needs to become a decent hero, like, stat. Because it will take some time for our new friend to level up. However, he does have some benefits to him. He's got a lot of troops coming his way. Let's sneak past the highest level enemies from our own faction, yes. How would it increase the bird, but apparently not. Let's see if we can... Increase. Okay. Can we do that multiple times? Yes. Okay, we can improve one per. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I am more fairies. Fantastic. This is why cheap enemies are so. As uh, cheap, cheap people are so good. You can hire hundreds of them. Oh, it requires blacksmith and a barracks. Oops, okay. Okay, well, at least we'll be able to start building soon. Alright, the other one. Also, just keep hiring fairies. That's your whole job right now. Oh, yeah, it did. The, if I do the weaker ones, right? Do the weaker ones increase by more? Yes, it does. Okay. All right, cool. You can keep on. Already learned. Already learned. Okay. Learn Earth. Okay. Now, if that's the case, you can go back and pick up more troops. Oh yeah, you are. You are going to be rolling in new troops pretty soon. I'm going to keep you around for a couple more days just so you can take advantage of the new um day, the new month. And then we'll move you on from there and you can start actually doing some stuff. Or you probably already can start doing some stuff. I wouldn't mind getting that third spell unlocked. And ogres, there's a fair number of them. Hmm. We are getting more stuff, but so are the enemies around us. It's a hundred days till the enemy starts becoming a little bit more worrying. So we still got time on that. It's those four, 94 days. Maybe that was a little bit... Didn't realize how quickly, the, how slowly those weeks went, but okay. Alright, hire everyone, because now you can. Upgrade if you can. These troops, you can't. You can't afford them. That's okay. We'll move you here. There we go. Probably wait out the clock for a little bit there anyway. I'm guessing. I know we can still technically afford... Wait, we can't? Huh. How can I not... Cost per troop. I got all that money. Oh, did I spend it all and it just hasn't upgrade updated yet? Ah, I spent it all and it hasn't updated yet. Gotcha. That makes sense, I suppose. All right. Let's see. So let's see if this character can do his first bit of combat. 
I'm a little bit apprehensive after last time. You know, no, we still got some more exploration to do before he's at max power anyway. So he can go up to, to Northern Island and to the northern part of this island and can power up as well that way. You can just wait for another little bit. I'm probably being less active than the easy enemy uh, the easy enemy at this point, but anyway. There we go. That's looking much more healthy. Also trade a little bit more of this for gold. And a little bit more of this for gold as well. Even a little bit of this for gold might work. Okay. Hire everyone else. And we've got a full army at least till tomorrow. Well, you can keep moving to the north. So if I did kill these Grand Elves and these others on the way, I could actually have a nice pathway that goes there. Well, actually, that's one we haven't been to yet, either. Okay. Fine, next turn. Week two. Of month four. Never mind, we definitely have less than a day left. Oh god, if we've been doing... Oh, actually, no, we are. It is actually increasing a lot farther than I thought. How many days have we went for? It's month four. That could actually be over 100 by now, anyway. Okay. It is also pausing or freezing right now. Don't crash me, game. I have a bad feeling the game might not want to play anymore. Uh-oh. It is now saying it's frozen. Okay, well that's, I'll see if it, the game actually auto-saved, but um, if not, we might be done for now. Let's find out. So we load game, scenario, auto-save. How long, how much did we lose? Wait, that's not, that's a completely different game. So not that one. Load game. Scenario. All. Random. Oh, hello. Don't know which order it goes. Okay, one, two humans, one computer, one water island, three monsters, era map, red is human. Okay, let's load this one then. Ah, there we go. And... Okay, this is literally turn before. Fantastic. Yay for autosaves, especially when they're quick. Though, it also does seem to be doing the same thing over again. Uh oh. That is concerning. Come on. Yeah. 
Okay. Well, I'll have to try this again later, I guess. Log crashing, log crashing, game freeze. Hmm. Well, annoying. Nothing seems to say how you can deal with it either. They just said, oh, I'll just give you a list of things which are safe to enable. It's like, well, wait, what? What does that mean? Because, <laughs> like, realistically... Hmm... Let's see here, so we got the dingy, the tools. Problem is it's not actually closing everything. So let's go back a couple of turns. Maybe it's just something that happened because we got unlucky. Back to 16. Okay. This is the different one. Okay, so this is last turn. This is fine, I think. Okay, still gotta wait another turn to buy the rest of these troops. Okay. If it does crash that easily, just like it's on the largest map, that would be a little bit concerning and a shame, to be honest. Oh, cool. Can we please search the graves? Yeah, because it was it was done already, please. Alright, Warlord's Banner, additional bonuses in combat. Sounds good to me. I'll do it. No, we don't want to fight more things. Come on. Let's try being in a completely different spot than we were last time, basically. That is my goal, being a completely different sort last, than last time we finished this. Okay, nothing special this week. Okay, well, we got past it. I th wait, or not? Oh. Different stuff's happening this time. It's actually moving and clicking around the... Oh, here we go. Crashing starts about three weeks into the game and always on opponent's turn only. Or just if it's on hope, it just happens again. Well, I guess, worst case scenario, I'll just go check out. Hmm. Worst case scenario, I can always just do another, another video with the other Heroes My Magic mods and see what out changes. This one apparently is a little unstable, The Wake of the Gods. But also, it's, a, it's the oldest one. We go check out Horn of the Abyss or Master of Puppets. I think Master of Puppets said it solved a few of these problems, so I might go with that one. Um, but yeah, for now, I guess that's unfortunately the end of the video. It's kind of a shame when something just breaks. Um, so yeah, I might have to play around myself and see what else I can do. Maybe I'll come back when I've got a nicer, bigger empire um, going. For now, though, it's still fun. And I can definitely see myself playing more of it in general, which is why I'm happy to have mods like that. Uh, here we go. Wog Debog. Let's see here. Wog debug 2, Wog debug 
He's a that's odd. Why is it found all the way? These wog logs are all the way back from 2014. Obviously, when I last played it, maybe I should make sure I've done a. Yeah, I think I might make sure I've done a. I think it installed on the wrong version of Here Is My Magic. I think it installed on a very old, very dirty copy of Here Is My Magic. So that might be the cause. I'm going to go back. I'm going to play a little bit around. I'm going to delete my old version. Um. And I'm going to reinstall it. And then we're going to see what happens later. So thank you for joining me today. Um, I still have fun with, um, with this. Here is my Magic 3. I think it's a great game. And I think, realistically, yeah, it definitely beats Hero Hour. Even if Hero's Hour is, like, technically better. It doesn't crash as much. It looks pretty in its own way. It's um, newer. It's definitely a little easier to play. But there's something to be said for the classics um, and the difficulty and the fact they didn't just get completely sidelined. Like the idea that the AI just runs ran straight for me via the water and any loss was like a total loss. Whereas this time I felt like I had a bit of an even chance. Anyway, I'll see you next time. This has been Here's My Magic 3. I'll see you. Goodbye.